So SSD prices have been trending downwards over the past decade to the point where some PC builders think that buying a hard drive is not worth it anymore. So the question is, should you buy a hard drive when building a PC today? Well in short, the answer is yes. However, there are a lot of aspects to consider when making this decision and in some cases, I think that buying a hard drive is not worth it anymore. This is Sukjit Singh from the Hardware Hub and let's get right into the video. Now the major trend that's causing us to ask this question is declining SSD prices. So NAND flash memory is what is used to store data on an SSD and the price of NAND memory has been trending downwards especially in the past few years in mainstream electronics. SSDs are still more expensive than hard drives but they offer much faster speeds and much higher reliability than hard drives which is why many consider hard drives to be obsolete. However, there are definitely some reasons to buy a hard drive for your next PC. The first reason is affordability. For $50 to $60 nowadays, you can get a name brand 2 terabyte hard drive, which is pretty hard to beat. An SSD in the $55 to $60 price range is only going to get you around 500GB of storage, which is less storage than it sounds like. If you can survive on 500GB of storage, then the SSD is the better option. However, with program files being pretty large these days and games being even larger, I find that 500GB of storage is going to be filled up pretty quickly if you're storing games and media files on the SSD. If you can buy a small SSD and wait for a hard drive upgrade, then buying the SSD will be the better option. However, if you have a smaller budget and do not want to upgrade your storage for a while, sticking to a hard drive will be better since you can store all of your data and you won't really notice a real difference compared to an SSD when it comes to gaming. Now there are some situations where it's strongly suggesting avoiding a hard drive at least for the main drive for your PC. First of all, if you have a PC budget of more than $1000, then your primary storage drive should be an SSD. A 1TB SSD costs around 100 bucks and is definitely affordable in a $1000 plus dollar PC build. In this sort of situation, a hard drive would only be for offloading and storing files that you do not want to access regularly. Now another situation where I'd say a hard drive doesn't make sense would be if you are a content creator who edits large files on their PC because a slow storage drive can be a bottleneck in your workflow. Now an example of when this would be helpful would be if you're editing large 4K video clips. Your experience when editing with an SSD will be noticeably smoother because your computer can access the video files much more quickly and this will reduce stuttering. As a content creator, I could definitely say that this is absolutely the biggest benefit I noticed after adding an SSD to my PC. So to sum that up, if you're spending more than a thousand bucks on your game PC or are a video editor, I'd strongly recommend buying an SSD because the performance that you gain will make sense in those situations. I think that at this point in time, we are not at the point where we can disregard hard drives when building a PC. A hard drive is still great for budget gamers who just need to store their files and something that's still great for higher end users who might need some cheap mass storage to offload their least used files. Now would you recommend buying a hard drive for someone building a PC today? Let me know in the comments down below. But yeah guys that's all for today, if you liked the video please be sure to hit the like button, if you didn't like it please dislike this video and subscribe for more content and I'll see you guys in the next one.